Lex, I've always admired your confidence, your resilience, your giving nature and selfishness when it comes to helping those you love. And I always wondered who would be the person to match you, to keep up with you, to have the same drive, the same determination, and to have a better credit score. And Gabe, I don't know if you do, but you made it this far, so it must be pretty good. <laughs> Gabe, thank you for being the other half to my best friend. You are a generous and kind-hearted person who always says yes to another golden retriever, <laughs> has some pretty sick dance moves, and constantly keeps Alexis on her toes. <laughs> Looking back now, it's easy to see how your friendship developed into the loving relationship we all see today. And I've been fortunate enough to watch it grow throughout the years from supporting each other through college, moves, new jobs, and everything life has thrown at you. And I have no doubt that the love you share will continue to deepen as you enter this new stage of life as husband and wife. So let's toast to the new Mr. and Mrs. Unruh. Remember tonight for is the beginning of always. I am Max. Uh, I am <laughs> Gabriel's college roommate, three years. I think the main thing I want to say is that on our bachelor party, I asked Gabriel the all important question why is Lex the one? Which I think goes through everyone's mind. When you see two people that want to spend the rest of their lives together, what makes that person special? And Gabriel said to me, Lex pushes me. She challenges me to be better than I was the day before always seeking to be a better person, to wake up, to challenge, to go to bed, and to do it again. And I know that in the time that I've known Gabriel, I've pushed him for better or worse, to better or worse decisions. Nights that have ended up with him leaping onto his, our uh, lofted bed in the, in the dorm room, like the former Platt High School track star that he was. <laughs> but now Lex is there for the day to day for every day. Today, on our wedding day, I want you to remember the life we have built together. We are so blessed and we have done and continue to do everything we set our mind to. You continue to amaze me every day. You keep our life and more importantly, me sane every day. You make me a better person and I couldn't go through life without you. You are my rock on the hardest days and my sunshine on the brightest days. I know we have so many adventures left to have. Love, Little Dog. Oh, oh, look at that belly! Oh, look at that belly! Lex kept saying, okay, are you gonna write something down for the speech? And I said, yeah, yeah, I'll get to it, I'll get to it. And so this morning she said, okay, what are you gonna say for your speech? And I said, oh, I'll get to it, I'll get to it. I'll write in, I'll write in the party bus, maybe, maybe. Um, but the truth is, those of you that know me know that I'm a little bit of a historian. And I get that from my grandpa, Frank. Um, and so I was trying really hard to find a connection between the state of New Jersey and the state of Missouri. I actually went to the public library in Jersey City pulled some books off the shelf. I said, I'm gonna find a connection between the two states. Here's the moral of the story. I couldn't find one damn connection between New Jersey and Missouri. I tried really hard to establish a connection because you're a Jersey girl, you dragged me to New Jersey, I kinda love it now. And I, I tried so hard because she's fell in love with Missouri. I said, we're gonna find something that connects us and I couldn't and I said, okay. That's fine, because if there's something about Lex and I, it's that we're trailblazers. And so I said, that's fine that New Jersey and Missouri don't have anything in common, because Lex and I will start that history. And so tonight, we start the long and trodden history of New Jersey and Missouri with this wedding.
is my honor and pleasure to introduce to you, to family, friends, and Christian community, Mr. and Mrs. Unru. Now you can give the kiss of love.